Let me show you what this bad boy can do. So I picked up another 6x6 six six Polaris, and the guy said, the only thing wrong with it is the carb is needing cleaning. The recoil rope broke, and there's something with the starter. I pulled the starter rope, and it doesn't seem like the engine moved. Uh, the guy wouldn't budge on the price. I paid $2,200 for it. So let's see if he's right. If he's right, this will be a quick, easy fix and a nice profit. If not, I might have got screwed. Let's see if the engine's locked up. So the engine is really clean. That's why I kind of took the guy's word for it. Transmission, this thing must have been in the garage. So I took the guy's word for it. Well, would you look at that? Flywheel's rusty, Bendix gear is rusted tight, which is why the pull start rope broke and the starter won't work. So maybe it's just uh, replacing the Bendix gear and or cleaning the carb. That'd be sweet. Take the flywheel off. There's all this rusty and crusty stuff in there. And little chunks of shit in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean that up, put a new gear in, clean off the stator, because that's all nasty. I cleaned up the stator real nice, and uh, I took the flywheel off, because a lot of times when the starter rope breaks, the spring inside of it, um, inside of the recoil part, usually busts off and sticks to the magneto and then when the flywheel spins you'll hear tick, 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 and uh, you'll wonder what that issue is. So I pulled that off, I found the spring laying stuck to the stator. I also made sure I cleaned this all off nice because that reads your spark. And look how rusty and crusty that is and look at that. There is part of the uh, recoil spring. So that would make some noise and cause some interference. So I'm going to clean this all up, put her back together, and it should fire up, I hope, unless that carburetor is drunk. Ha! <laughs> gotta love it. Gotta run in a couple minutes. Nice. So there's some easy repairs out there. If you know what you're doing, you just gotta look for them. Stay tuned. I'll probably uh, go through the carb and get this thing running real good.